Hello, I am Test Drive, and welcome to episode 7 of Project Gotham Racing 2, where we are going to be starting on the Coop series, because it is what's next. First off, we have some night tracks, which is different. We haven't done anything night related yet in this game, which is pretty cool, because this game features night and also some weather, like rain and tracks. Um, but yeah, we get to see night racing for the first time. So we have a timed run to start us off. We have the Audi TT Coupe. Which I think is the 3.2 Quattro. I think that's why it's a class higher, technically. Uh, the Mazda RX-8. And the Honda Integra Type R. Not the Acura RSXS, oddly enough. So, we'll start off with these two, because I have them unlocked. And we'll see where it takes us from there. I want my RX-8 to be... Blue, yes. That is a very... Color. Yes. I don't think I've ever seen... Ooh, I got the hiccups and burps and stuff. Uh, I've never, I don't think I've ever seen an RX-8 IRL that's been that color blue. Or that shade of blue. I'm in Sydney, Australia. God, I've been seeing so much stuff about Australia. And all I can think about when I think of Australia is this track in this game. Or, like, the fact that Sydney is in this game. Alrighty, Chicane. Thank you for, uh, thanks for following and thanks for checking out the stream. You have a good night. Hopefully see it in a stream in the future. Oh god. And we get to see the uh, the interesting so because I'm a giant nerd. I pay attention to a few very specific things, pretty hardcore in games. Uh, and those things are odometers, which as you've known from like my Midnight Club 3 or Midnight Club LA series. And I probably talked about it in this game with it being on heads of display and also test drive unlimited. And other than that, I'm really like uh, particular about the lights on cars, on exteriors of cars, and also gauge lights and stuff. Um, but yeah, we get to see the bizarre's very interesting choices for uh, the lights on cars in this game. As you can tell, we're starting off great because the side marker lights are the only tail lights on this car. Uh, the brake lights are not the tail lights, apparently, according to Bizarre Creations. Uh, whatever floats their boat, I guess, is whatever floats my boat. But this is only a uh, only the beginning of that. It gets weirder, trust me. As we get further through the game, you'll see. I forgot how short the episodes are going to be in this game, too. For the way I'm doing it. Because these races... Oh, God. Even the later races aren't that long in this game. So there's going to be, like, 30, 40 episodes of... Oh, it's a timed run. Okay. Uh, of just, like, 10 to 15 minute episodes at most. The last episode might be a little bit long. Well, the last episode of the career, because it has a fairly long race in it. But that's really far down the line. Like I said, it's probably going to be, who knows, 30, 40 episodes, probably, of this game. If not more, honestly. I don't even know how long this game will actually be, like, episode-wise. Or time-wise, honestly. But we re received more, four, more, four, four more kudos tokens. Blibbity blah 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 And... Let's get on to the street race. So we will get... No, I don't want to use that yet. We use one car per episode. Just like Forza. Let's make this car red. Because I've seen RX-7s in that color, I'm pretty sure. In that specific shade of red, at least. Street race. Come in third place or higher. And we'll get started as soon as it decides to do the thing. Uh, I'm not ready. Okay, I'm ready. Imagine. Long intro, and then I'm still not ready by the end of it, because I'm looking at Twitter. <laughs> but you can also see the... Uh... So, it's weird because Bizarre apparently just had like a, a thing with making the taillights and brake lights on almost every car a different light. 
even though on most of these cars the taillights also serve as brake lights like on this car and also the Integra that's in front of me which we'll see in the next episode because that's the car I'm going to use in the next episode spoiler alert um, but yeah Sydney is pretty cool I love the the different aesthetic of cities in this game like it, it's not a huge huge difference of like aesthetic of sorts uh, between the different cities but they definitely do all have their own style and uh, it was cool because I drove last year, a year ago, not this past weekend, not past, well, yeah, I guess it was the past weekend because it's technically a Friday. Uh, I drove to Chicago then, but I also drove to Chicago about a year ago and I actually drove through downtown Chicago and the Chicago map in this game, which you'll see later on, I think, I don't think you've already seen it yet, um, it's like, I'm like, wow, that looks familiar and oh yeah, it's, that's it. I saw that in PGR too and so on and so forth. So they do have some realism, realism, realism to them. Jeez, I cannot talk tonight. Bruh, what's going on? Is that a 350Z up there? Hello, sir. Brother. He's fast. RX, I'm not going to lie, the RX-8 is probably the slowest car in this entire... Uh, section of the game. It's very, very slow. Hello! Wow, okay. Apparently that's how you pass a 350Z and an RX-8. And possibly stay past. I'm not sure if I'm going to, but I'll try. Oh, I'm in second? Hold on. Hold the fuck up. So there's an Audi S4. I can guarantee it's the Audi S4 somewhere well out ahead of me. So, uh, yeah, the RX-8 is definitely not the optimal choice for uh, these races, especially if you're on a harder difficulty, Al. Like, I am on silver, so I have to get in third or better, uh, which is always third or better. Well, up to silver, it's third or better, but then uh, the AI just gets harder. But then... When you go to gold and platinum, the AI gets harder, and also the uh, you have to get in a higher position. You have to get in second or first. I mean, if you do gold or platinum. Got the Audi so fast. I can I remember the Audi being stupid OP in this game, and it looks like that's what's happening. But oh well, I'm not too worried about it. Like I said, all I have to do is get in, um, in third, and I'm in second, so we're Gucci. Luis Finito. Ah. Continue. I need to remember to save replays. I did not do that for the last episode, and it's I'm going to have to go back and record, or uh, get a fucking thumbnail of some sort. But anyways, our third race here is a, uh, what else saying? Speed camera. To get to 87 miles per hour, which is questionable in the RX-8, as you can imagine. But, well, I, I bet I can do it. On silver, at least, I can probably do it. If we were talking gold or platinum, I would highly doubt I could do it. God, I tried for so long, too, on the original, uh, like, the most complete profile I have of this game um, I tried for so hard to get platinums on all the speed cameras and there were some I just could not get and it wasn't like I was using a, an underpowered car or anything it was I was using the most powerful car because there are usually like one or two uh, cars that will always win pretty much in each of the uh, the sections no matter what section it is like for the sports convertible, it was a Porsche Boxster and the other car. Uh, in sport compact, it was the Lancia Delta, and I think the Focus RS was also a really fast car in that. In this one, it's the Audi S4 and the BMW M3 CSL. That's gonna be a really short episode. Next episode. All right. So <laughs> sorry if you wanted to see a lot of the Integra. Apparently, you're not going to. But anyways, uh, that will conclude this episode of PGR Two, not Four. 
So thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.